Welcome back, everyone. Toys is here, and I am back yet again for, yes, another early look at an upcoming San Diego Comic-Con 2024 exclusive. And this time it comes courtesy of my friends over at NECA Toys from the old classic 80s television show, ALF. We all remember Gordon Shumway. Yeah, he's back with a second round of his Comic-Con shenanigans. He loved Comic-Con so much last year, He's finally taken to cosplaying, and cosplaying he is, because he's all decked out in his super attire. It's not a bird, it's not a plane. Why, it's Super Alf, and I love the little flappy opening. You can see the figure inside. Now, I would say this is probably one of the most perfect San Diego Comic-Con exclusives, much like the Alf from last year. If you're not a huge action figure collector, if you're not really a collector at all, but you want something that reminds you of perhaps your first time going to Comic-Con or your 30th time going to Comic-Con, as in my case. And yeah, I would say that'd be the ideal collectible for your shelf. Get it going in one of your Skype meetings. Put it in the background. People go, what is that? And you go, oh, yeah. <laughs> Why, that's Alf. Ah, now, here's everything that this figure will come with, along with everyone involved with the creation of this figure. So, as always, thank you very much for that. Now, if you head over to Blainer Things over on Instagram, he and Thomas Quinn will take you on a rundown of all the thought process and the dealings and the creativity that went in to creating this San Diego Comic-Con exclusive. That's definitely cool. I'll put the links down in the description below. And, of course, here's the barcode, but you're not going to need that because, yes, ALF is a true San Diego Comic-Con exclusive. So if you are attending the con, you can head over to the NECA booth and grab one for yourself. Otherwise, starting June 26th through the 28th, you can head over to the NECAstore.com and pick up a Super ALF for yourself. So this is going to be an absolute blast. Sit back, relax, hide your cats. I'm not even joking. He is a ravenous Wild Alien. This is an early look at the brand new San Diego Comic Con 2024 exclusive Super Alf by NECA Toys. So now here is everything out of the packaging, and I would say that it's just the perfect amount of accessories, but the accessories themselves have so much charm to them that it's pure Comic-Con magic. Now, of course, you're going to get a bevy of extra hands. You've got furry, fisted hands. You, of course, got pointy hands. And then, oh, always my personal favorite, the thumbs up hand. Now, you do get a selfie stick with a photo of Alf already taken, and that's quite cool. But the selfie stick itself is just very unique. It does not extend, but it does have articulation where the camera is, and I love that you can just kind of position that. This will make for some fun photos, I'm just gonna say. I don't have a selfie stick accessory for any of my figures, so that itself uh, opens up a whole new way of, of just creativity, I'm sure, over on my socials. And yes, part of the fun is taking photos, and it's exactly what you see on the camera. Don't forget, it does flip when you take a selfie, so yes, the picture is correct on the phone. You also get a poster of Super Alf. Apparently, Alf has a booth this year at SDCC, and he's hawking his wares. And it feels like a tiny miniature poster, except that you really can't roll it up like you'd want. You're going to damage it, ultimately, because he does come with a poster tube, and that is a mainstay for anybody walking around San Diego Comic-Con. The lid even opens. It's perfect. It's one of the coolest accessories next to the selfie stick. It's just perfection through and through. But like I said, if you want to fold up the poster, you could... Slip the poster in there, I suppose. But I like that with the various hands that Alf comes with, he can hold the poster and he can pose or you can put the poster tube on him. And what is fun for the poster tube, if you want to stick these stickers all over, you get a cool sticker sheet with some clever nods to everything Alf, Comic-Con, free cat food. Yes, Deadpool, Captain America, Wonder Woman. They're all represented. No problem whatsoever as the sticker says but circle gets the square because alf is just a lot of fun so it's the alf body that we've seen with a bunch of different alf releases count how many times i say alf in this video he's got his cool clodhopper converse going on nice treads on the bottom he's got peg holes 
He has a full cloth goods costume. And what is appealing to me about this is kind of like Bartman, right? Remember the old Simpsons episode where Bart goes to the Bymon sci-fi con and he goes, oh, I'm Bartman. Well, Alf showed up as Alf Man or Super Alf. And it's just a homemade costume complete with a cape with a bendy wire. It's not the strongest of bendy wires, but it's a very nice high quality cape. It's very heavy. It's almost like a blanket, like that is what he cut up and put around his neck. He's got basically a belt, a woman's belt, or you could say just a, a rather large weightlifter's belt for his utility belts. The costume is all sewn really nice. Just go easy at first, much like I said about the Earl Sinclair Captain Impressive. Get to know the articulation before you just start kind of moving it all around. You don't want to twist anything wrong. You don't want to get any of the fabric caught in the joints. It's a little bit of a waste. And again, I love the Jimbo Jones cord as his belt around his waist. Plenty of articulation in the head. And I love the fact that his mouth opens and closes. I think that's a nice touch. You get Alf a talking, have the jaw open. And when you kind of put the neck forward, it looks like he's talking. He's a Muppet from space, whatever Alf is at this point. The legs will kick out. You got single jointed knees. They'll spin at the knee. The big old converse will rotate. Again, for the type of character that is Alf, and let alone Super Alf, you can get his arms going all the way up and get him flying away. And that's what I like about these Alfs. Last year's San Diego Comic-Con exclusive from NECA Toys was one of my favorites that any company did. It's just pure Comic-Con fun. And much like that one before, this one is now. And likewise, being that he is a super alf, you can have him team up with the Justice League. Uh, perhaps there's a cat in a tree and, well, alf is quote unquote trying to help it. Ah, now, if you don't want to go the actual superhero route, you can have a lot of fun with the selfie stick and have it to be just a bunch of cosplayers hanging out, taking photos. Sky's the limits with these accessories. And yes, this is the fourth NECA Toys SDCC 2024 exclusive that we have taken a look at thus far. We have two more to go. But again, like all the ones you see before you, ALF is not detrimental to any collection. It's just a fun San Diego Comic-Con collectible to grab if you are attending San Diego Comic-Con. So that will wrap it up for my early look at the Super ALF San Diego Comic-Con 2024 exclusive by NECA Toys. And again, thank you to my friends over at NECA for sending this out for the purposes of this video. I like the cloth goods. I love the accessories. Those can also be used with other figures, but it just embodies the idea of cosplaying, dressing up as a superhero, DIYing it yourself, having your selfie stick, taking photos, getting the posters, walking around the booth. Yes, they nailed it. This is fun. It's just goofy. It's Alf through and through. And that's why I loves it. So you've heard my thoughts. Now I'm curious to know yours. Comment below. Let me know. Let's talk everything. Alf. And I'm going to leave you guys with that. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food. But most importantly, remember, well, he went casually last year. Now he's cosplayed. So then next year, he's got to go full furry suit, right? Just cat costume Alf all the way. When he does, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios.